I am here with a nine month old Beva Terrier puppy. As you can see, his ears are flopping. This is due to the fact that he has too much hair on his ears and that is holding his ears down. So we need to get rid of the weight of the hair on his ears. For this, I'm going to use a 15 blade on an Artero Spectra 4-in-1 clipper. I have this process slowed down so that you can see clearly what I'm doing. I have my thumb on the outside of the ear and I have my fingers on the inside of the ear. I'm going to use my index finger to slide up the ear as I clip it. So with my thumb on the outside, my finger on the inside, I'm going to go straight up the middle of the ear. Slide the clipper and my finger up with the ear leather in between. As you can see, he threw his head back, but I had a very light touch. And I go back in and secure the ear again. I'm not holding him by the ear, I'm simply keeping the ear safe. Index finger on the outside, thumb on the inside. Clipper going straight up the middle. My index finger is going to slide up with it. This is in very slow motion. He's throwing his head back, which actually enables the clipper to slide up the ear and works to my advantage. We'll switch to the other side. Here the camera is not slowed down. You can see it in real time. It is scary because they wiggle so much. They don't like the noise of the clipper and the vibration so close to their ears. So I'm using my fingers as guides to keep the ears safe. Now his ears are going up nicely because the weight of the hair has been taken off. That's a good boy. What a good boy you are. So I need to get the edges, so I'll start from the center and work out towards each edge. Go straight up from the middle and then straight out to the edge. Good boy, you're okay. Stay on the table. Good boy. Wait. He is showing signs that he doesn't like it. And I'm being very gentle and reassuring. He's looking at me like, what did you do that for? I don't understand. <laughs> He's saying, stop it. Just stop it. Thanks for watching.